So as you can tell by the title of this video, I will be sharing with you guys some of my mom and toddler life hacks with you. I'm actually really excited about this video because I'm always looking for super easy, quick ways to make my days run smoothly as possible. So most of these, well, actually all of these are what I use on a daily basis to keep my days just going. Some of them may seem like the obvious or you may even use these in your daily routine. I just wanted to share with you guys some of my go-to favorite life hacks. Jumping right into it, the first five lifestyle hacks fall under the mom category. Not only does it help me stay organized, but it does help my life as a parent that much easier. Using a slow cooker or instant pot for easy and time-saving meal preparation. This has been a lifesaver of mine from not having to just slave in the kitchen all day, every day. I would do that and my toddler would not eat. I would prep it in the morning, throw pot roast, chicken, or any kind of meats that you like. Just throw it all in there with your veggies and everything and let it just cook for about six hours. And so by dinner time, you're able to just serve. I also want to share this hack too. I like to freeze the coffee that I made from the morning so that I can make iced coffee for later. By the next morning, it'll be done freezing and I'll be able to make me an iced coffee by simply pouring the coffee creamer over the cubes and topping it off with a little whipped cream. And voila, you have a nice, refreshing, yummy drink. Number two is probably one that's kind of like one of the obvious. Keeping a stash of healthy pre-packed snacks when you're about to dip out for the day. I always have to have my toddler's water with me as well as some snacks. It helps because I pre-portion them or pre-pack them so that I can just grab them and go. Stick them in the diaper bag and I'm able to just go. Yes. Using a shower caddy to organize bath essentials. It has been a lifesaver of mine. Putting your bath bubbles, shampoo, conditioner, all of the essentials that you need for the bath, just putting it on the shower caddy will save you time, energy, and your sanity. <laughs> Setting up a designated charging station for all of the electronics. This includes phone, iPad, camera, AirPods, watches, any device that needs a charge. This not only keeps them organized, but it ensures that they're always ready to use. So, Keeping your emergency kit in your car with essentials like first aid kit, extra change of clothes, diapers, wipes. I even put snacks in there. This really helps when you're out and about nowhere near home. It seems like the moment we leave the house, my toddler decides to get dirty whether on her own or with the help of her dad deciding to give her the messiest snack possible. Either way, this hack definitely provides a peace of mind knowing you have backup everything. So if you're a parent and you have not tried this hack, please do. I guarantee it would make your life so much easier. Next are some parent life hacks that will help simplify your day-to-day -day and also promote a smoother, an easier parent experience. Caddy, use a diaper caddy or organizer to keep all diaper changing essentials together in one place. I basically just leave this organizer in her top drawer of her dresser. I find it easier to just grab this bin and go when I know I'll be in another area of the house or outside by the pool. It helps that I have to go back and forth for basic diaper essentials. Routine. Create a bedtime routine to establish a consistent sleep schedule to signal to your baby that it is time for sleep. We follow the same exact bedtime routine every night so she knows what to expect. This one may seem like one of the obvious, but rotating your kids' toys, as well as the bath toys, it will help tremendously in terms of them getting bored easily and wanting something new and fresh. I really like this hack because it helps my daughter not get bored of her toys. She will see a toy that she hasn't played with in a while and be all into it like it was just purchased or something. Not only do I switch out the main toys, but I also make sure to switch out her bath toys, car toys, 
in all the books as well. The next five are my favorite Tyler hacks to help keep your Tyler entertained and help promote independence and development. Pick and paint rocks. Just hear me out. This one is super nostalgic for me. This is inspired by me when I was a little girl. I used to love going outside and finding different types of rocks. I would pick out as many as I could and go back inside and paint them with nail polish. I would paint them with different colors and designs and I literally had a huge collection of rocks. This makes me happy because one thing my daughter absolutely loves doing is playing with rocks. It's pretty cool to share these moments with her. Use a non-slip mat or bath mat near the pool to help prevent your toddler from slipping by the pool. This prevents your toddler from slipping and falling on wet surfaces. It gives you that peace of mind to know that your toddler is safe around the pool. Use a cookie sheet as a portable magnetic board for your toddler to play with magnetic letters and numbers. My daughter absolutely loved playing with these letters and numbers. She had a ball. I really like that it does teach independence and it helps with their development. Create a designated rest area in the pool by placing a floating mat or an inflatable lounge chair in the pool for your toddler to take breaks and relax. It keeps from having to get in and out of the pool each time and I also like to keep snacks and water nearby. And last on the list, practicing self-care. Setting aside time for yourself, whether that be taking a bath, reading a book, watching your favorite show, playing your favorite game, just taking time for yourself and enjoying that moment to just regroup and relax. I hope you guys enjoy watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and share. Subscribe to join me for more. Bye.